Hi everybody, my name is Dave Marsh and I'd like to welcome you to this Matrix version 6.0 overview. Now before I begin, I'd like to mention that because each MLS system has slightly different requirements, the system that we'll be using during this presentation may differ slightly from the one that you'll be working with. Nevertheless, the functionality is the same and for the most part, whatever you see during this tutorial, you'll easily recognize in your own system. Now we're not going to get into anything too specific during this presentation, but I am going to highlight some of the new and exciting features that you're really going to want to get familiar with. First off, I'd like to begin by saying that Matrix 6.0 is completely compatible with all major mobile devices and operating systems. So what this means is the features that you will come to know on your desktop are also available on your iPads and other popular tablets. Okay, so logging into the system. The first thing we notice is a series of customizable widgets that are conveniently located on the home page. Now these widgets are essentially to allow quick access to the most commonly used matrix features such as recent news items, hot sheets, favorite searches, contacts, as well as others. And speaking of contacts, let's begin by doing a search for an existing client, Mr. Weiser, who is interested in purchasing some property from me. Well, there are a few different ways we can go about finding listings for Mr. Weiser. So let's begin by taking a look at the standard, old, familiar approach, and that's by plugging the information directly into the search criteria section. So let's assume that Mr. Weiser is looking for residential property priced between $500,000 and $800,000 with two plus bedrooms and three plus bathrooms. And before I even view my results, I can already see that there are currently 955 matches. Alright, so let's go ahead and do a search. And that takes us to our results page where we can easily switch to another view, including single line, as well as click on any of the MLS links to see the full listing. Okay, so that's one way of viewing results. Of course, another way is by clicking on the map tab and from here we also have the same full control over all the listings that we had on the results tab with the advantage of actually being able to visualize where the listings are on a map. But let's assume now that Mr. Weiser would only like listings near the water. Well we can easily include or exclude as many locations as we need using the map shape tools. So let's for example choose the radius to include this area the rectangle to include this area and finally because we may want to avoid this part of town we'll use the polygon tool to exclude all listings in this area so with our updated listings Let's zoom in and just as an example take a look at this property. Okay, now that I know which listings I'd like to show, I can now select the ones that I'm interested in. Then click directions for detailed turn-by-turn -turn directions to each of the properties. In fact, the map will even reconfigure the most efficient route if I decide to change the start point. Alright, while each of those search features are great, what I'd really like to demonstrate is the third and perhaps most exciting method of doing a search, and that's by using our advanced speed bar. And what this speed bar does essentially is use a simple Google-like approach to allow the agent to enter search criteria from anywhere in the system to quickly find results. So let me illustrate this by creating a brand new speed bar search from scratch. 
And remember, I can use a speed bar from anywhere in the system. So I'll demonstrate that by returning to our home page. And from here, I'll enter the following shorthand criteria. Active, residential, between $500,000 and $800,000, with two plus bedrooms and three plus bathrooms. Okay, so with our search criteria entered, let's click the search icon. And again, we see too many results. Well, we know our client, Mr. Weiser, is only interested in the listings closer to the lake. So this time, instead of redrawing the general area, let's enter one of my predefined speed bar shortcuts named Lakeside to better isolate the locations. And again, from here, we can also choose to select which listings we'd like to map driving directions for. Another useful feature of the speed bar is for quickly finding agent contact information. So simply by adding the word agent, followed by either the last name or a partial last name, we can see a list of all agents in the system who fit that criteria. Okay, so let's switch gears now and use our search to create a brand new auto email that will alert Mr. Weiser whenever a new listing that meets his criteria becomes available. So using our recent search dropdown, which essentially keeps a running list of all your previous searches, I'm going to find and select our lakeside search results. Now I'm going to click New Auto Email. Then, after filling in the mandatory fields, I'm going to click Save. And we can clearly see that Mr. Weiser has never been sent any of these listings in the past, so we can approve all. And the new auto email has now been created. Okay, so now I'm going to put on my client cap just for a moment and I'm going to open up one of the auto emails that was previously sent to Mr. Weiser and we're going to see how the portal looks from his perspective. So from my client's email account, I'll click on this link and the auto email that was sent opens up in a brand new tab. Alright, from here, let's click on the map link and we can zoom in to a bird's eye view of the properties. Okay, so now that I've had a look at some of the listings, I can easily return to my single line display and organize a few of them into my favorites, possibilities, and even discarded. But let's assume there is a price reduction on one of the discarded listings so that it's now under my consideration. Well, since discarded does not actually mean deleted listings, that property can very easily be moved to the possibilities or the favorites bucket. For now, we're just going to put it in the possibilities. All right, so let's return to Matrix. And back as an agent, I'm going to take a look at Mr. Wise's portal activity. Now a couple of ways I can do that. The quick way, for example, is by viewing the buckets under contacts. But for a more in-depth view, I can also open up Mr. Wise's portal in BCC mode, which basically means I can look at which properties my client may or may not be interested in, but I can't make any changes. All right, so the last thing I'm going to show you is one of the most sophisticated features Matrix has to offer and that's the Advanced Stats Generator. So starting with a search of any kind, agents can generate stats for a specific market area, time frame, status, or the entire MLS database. For example, 
Let's generate a simple stat with one of the presets called list price versus sales price for all residential properties in the entire MLS area between $500,000 and $800,000 with two plus bedrooms and three plus bathrooms. And what this tells me is that the list prices were slightly higher than the median sales from 2002 until 2010 with a significant differential in 2011. But what if I'm interested in a slightly more custom stat for a specific location? Well, let's use my predefined Lakeside Speed Bar shortcut for location. I'm going to show the sale price to the list price ratio as a column graph as well as the sales volume as a smooth line graph. And I'm going to group these graphs by month. For the years 2008 to 2010. So what these stats tell me is that people were generally paying more than the asking price during this time period and how the total sales dollar value relates to that. And once generated, these results can easily be printed off to include in a CMA or perhaps directly emailed to a client. Well these were just a few of the Matrix 6.0 features that we know you'll enjoy using. From searching to speed bar and auto prospecting to incredibly detailed statistics. Matrix 6.0 is the next generation MLS software that will help propel your business to the next level. Thank you for watching.